part five chapter five let's keep this mofo moving this is the demo uh this is the if you download the dead space 2 demo which i did a video on um this is what it is and i'm just rehashing shit i did the opening sequence video and then i did chapter one i did the demo video and now i'm in the demo yeah you're double watching my videos you stupid bastards free views same shit yeah <laughs> i'm just kidding that's I didn't plan it like that or anything. Okay, uh, can't go that way. Hmm. Skeleton people. Oh, that's all right. Fine. It's all right. Isaac's just a bit dehydrated, I think. Not really a big deal. I also did not notice. Uh, you could punch these fucking things in the demo. Somebody pointed out in the comment section that you can punch them. So thank you for telling me because I. Did not know that. The whole fucking demo I played that. And I was just like, what the shit? I figured you could open them by hitting the button. And that did not work. But punching them right off the fucking wall, that works great. Bia. Anytime I can bia something, it's always a plus. Text log. Alright, I'll read this text log because I haven't read audio logs. I'm just kidding. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not reading. You stupid ass. You thought I was going to read that? Uh, <clears throat> no, I won't. <clears throat> ah! I just downloaded the trial for that stacking game, and I'm not gonna promise I'm making a video on it. I haven't even played the fucking game yet, but uh, from watching um, the video, the videos that uh, Jeff made on him over at Achievement Hunter. <laughs> oh god, I missed. Check it out. Yeah, see that puke hurt me. That wasn't the uh, fucking. That wasn't the uh, slowdown puke. That was just in your face, take damage puke. But, uh, no, Jeff made the video of the Human Hunter, and it, actually, that game looks fucking fun as shit. I'm, I'm interested in, uh, playing that game, so I definitely want to check that out. So, if I can make a video about it, I'll give it a, I'll give it a whirl, but we'll see where that goes. Uh, oh, Zombie Murdoch, uh, 667. Shout out! Name drop! Name dropping! I mentioned that I should suck Visceral's dick. That's what he said. For not including any multiplayer achievements, and I have to agree with him. Uh, slurp, slurp, slurp. Because I didn't even play the multiplayer yet. I imagine I will have to play it. At, God damn it! I'll have to play it at some point, just just to see what it is. But you fuck. Um, I don't have to, because I already got all my fucking achievements without playing multiplayer. Thank God. Fuck you, Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Uh, I got all the single player achievements. I even went online and got I got like three or four of the multiplayer achievements just playing, and then I got a couple of the other ones with uh, playing with a couple of people on my friends list. So I have 48 achievements in the game, and the only two I'm missing are uh, get all the fucking combos uh, or whatever the fuck they're called in multiplayer. Like do all the um... I can't remember what the fuck it's called. It's like get get all the all the, the kill combinations. Like you get a little fucking uh, you get a little like they're all they're all labeled and shit. I, I sound like a stupid asshole because I can't remember what it's called. But uh, there's like fucking a bajillion of them you have to get, and you have to do it in ranked because there's some some of them you can only get in ranked. And the other one is get to level 50. I'm like I'm on like level fucking four or something because uh, unranked or custom. Uh, games you don't get experience. So no, I'm not playing that game to 50. I already did Bioshock 2. You motherfucker! Piece of shit! That pisses me off, as you fucking may have realized. You fucking asshole! God damn it! I just used a fucking health pack, and this fucking son of a bitch comes around the corner. Ugh. Yeah, you could just suck it. Suck it, bitch! I'm running out of things to yell at people when I kill them. Somebody made a comment. I should say something about, uh... Some, some ass... Just call somebody a fucking ass bag or some shit like that. I don't remember what it is. I was on the comment there. It was fucking... Uh, fucking retarded, but I'm... I'm, I'm running out here, so... Whatever you said, guy, just pretend like I said that. It makes you feel better. Because it's better than what I got. There's something around here. Some money over here somewhere. Or some shit. 
Oh, there you are. Yeah, you are. Gold semiconductor. Whoa! F bomb again. Swear to God, this Isaac Clark, such a fucking goddamn potty mouth. Yelling and hooping and hollering and killing. He's a murderer. These necromorphs have lives too, you know. Where's Hermione Granger when you need her? Fuck the stupid house elves. You need to make like a fucking save the necromorph because I'm a stupid fucking bitch act. That'll be the what's the axe called? Yeah. Hermione Granger. People that saw the movie and didn't read the book have no idea what the fuck I'm talking about, but it was fucking dumb and they didn't like it. And the house elves suck and they're fucking stupid. That dumb fucking bitch. Uh, uh, Barty Crouch's house elf, house elf that isn't even in the uh, Goblet of Fire uh, was in the book, and then she's like an annoying bitch through the rest of all the books, and she's a drunk because she drinks butter beer like a fucking drunk. It doesn't get it doesn't get the, the humans drunk, you know, the the kids and whatnot, but it fucks house elves up. I think I've only read the books once, but yeah, uh, house elves suck, and I fucking hate their guts. I'll just leave it at that. Fuck you, Dobby. I don't know. I don't know. I can't exactly pinpoint why the fuck I hate Dobby so much because he's so fucking annoying in the movie, in the second one. Like he's so goddamn annoying as a character. I saw the first four movies, and then I read all the well, not all the books. I read the first five books before seeing the fifth movie, and then I read um, the sixth book and then the seventh book, like right as it came out. So I read them all before, uh, by the time I got to the uh, sixth movie. Because I think the seventh book came out, like, right after the fifth movie or some shit. I don't know. Fucking nerd trilogy. Uh, trilogy. Jesus Christ. Uh, trivia. Stupid fuck. Um, but I... Go up, shithead. But I read the fucking... Uh, I, I saw the second movie before I read the book. So maybe I fucking hate Dobby because of the movie. And then, like, I just... I, what I did was I pictured all the characters from the movie and shit while reading the books. By the way, I fucking killed myself here on Hardcore because I tried to stasis that thing, and I thought I did, and I guess I missed. So right as I flew through it, it closed and fucking cut my head off. And I had to go... We're in Chapter 5 now. I had to go all the way back to that first save point that I saved in in the last video in Chapter 4. I had to go all the way back there because I got fucking decapitated because I'm a stupid moron and I flew through the fucking thing. Bitch cursing. Yeah? I'll jam you with something, mobile. <laughs> yeah! Tonight! You! Shopping at the store, got crap I don't need. Mm -hmm. Pull this shit out of storage. I'm get my ass kicked a little bit. get one node. I can only afford one node. No! Hell, there we go. But, uh, yeah, I like me, I like me some Harry Potter. Um, I, I know everybody realizes it's fucking retarded. That's a fucking hell of a lot better than Twilight. Uh, oh, Flame War! Ah, oh, he's starting to fight! He's starting to Flame War! Ah! Ah, oh, it's so hot in here! I'm burning alive! No. I am, I did just burn to death. But, that's cool. Because I'm moving stuff now. Now now we're getting to the best part of the game where you move stuff. You got these big things here. I don't know what the fuck they do, but somehow they're turning power on. Because I'm sliding them. You know? Because I'm sliding them. The Isaac slide. The Isaac shuffle, I like to call it. And then I'm going to almost run past this bench. <sighs> Alright, what do we got here? I got two moves. Could probably use some more health. Oh, fuck that. Oh, damage upgrade. But what I will do, which is kind of wasteful, but I'll move one space there, thus forcing me to put it into the HP next time. Because I might blow it off again. Gotta say that one, though. But yes, uh, back to Zombie Murdoch. I fucking love the fact that there's only single player achievements. Oh, Bioshock 2. Uh, fuck, fuck you, Zombie Murdoch. I'm going back to Bioshock 2. I got every single single-player achievement in Bioshock 2. I even got all the multiplayer achievements. A thousand the motherfucker. 
And then they came out with more fucking multiplayer achievements. So I went back later, whatever, months later. I got every goddamn achievement. I've mentioned this before. Probably in on my fucking Dead Space demo video. Um, but the only two fucking achievements I'm missing in that piece of shit game. It's actually not really a piece of shit, but I'm angry. Um, are the fucking multiplayer achievements uh, play each of the six new maps and win on each of the six new maps. That's it. And I've never done it because there's no fucking playlist for it. So I've never once... I've never once played on the new maps of like... Because I downloaded them when I had a shitload of multiplayer achievements to do. Or like all the new ones and stuff. I had to get from 40 because the last when I was done playing I capped level. That was at 40 and they bumped it to 50. So I had to get to 50 to rebirth. To get because you get an achievement for rebirthing, which is the same thing as prestiging in Call of Duty. You reset your shit. Uh, I re I got from 40 to 50, and then I rebirthed and went from one to like I think I'm like around 10 or 15 or whatever. So going from 40 to 50 and then one to 15, which is however many hours of playing online, I not once got a new fucking map. So I got fucked out of those two achievements. And what what sucks fucking ball sacks, which is such bullshit that Xbox Live does, is because you know you have your little hundred percent list. If you thousand a game and you fucking hundred percent it, say case in point, fucking uh, Left 4 Dead, Mafia 2, a thousand all those motherfuckers. Whenever DLC comes out, it takes it out, which is bullshit. Especially if I have no plan on ever buying it, like Dante's Inferno. Fuck you, Dante's Inferno. That game was mediocre at best. I'm not buying your fucking shitty DLC. Um, and I fucking hate that. That it, like, unthousands it. Mafia 2. They got the two new DLCs. Uh, well, they're not really new anymore, but Jimmy's Vendetta and Joe's Story. Oh, shit. I'm back up here. Those those are lurkers, by the way. Uh, there is an achievement for shooting, um... Shooting all three tentacles off them in one shot with the line gun. So you have to wait till their tentacles are, uh, are vertical like that. Because, uh... You can't change directions with the line gun, so if they're on the wall, then they're horizontal, and you know the line gun shoots a fucking horizontal line. So if the things are horizontal, it's a whole fucking thing. But uh, inept, the stupid motherfucker. Even though I told him exactly how to get the achievement, it all comes back to inept because he's really so stupid. Um, the stupid motherfucker was trying to get it for like two days, and I'm like, what? And he's like, dude, this fucking achievement's impossible to get. I can't get it. And I'm just like, you just suck. So he was crying about it. So the next day, he's still, it's day later, he's still crying about it. And he's like, oh, I almost got him. I just didn't get the tail. I'm like, tail? What the fuck are you talking about, tail? And then right when he said that, I knew what he was talking about. There's these little, I, I think they're called leapers or some shit. These little enemies that have no fucking um, legs. They're just two arms and a tail. And they crawl around and they fucking leap at you like assholes. I don't think I've come up to them yet. But... He was trying to do it on them, and I'm like, yeah, oh, I could see if it just said, like, do it on this guy, but it said, you gotta shoot the fucking tentacles off. That enemy doesn't have tentacles enough, you stupid shit. This guy's gonna take, like, a million shots, because I haven't upgraded my fucking uh, plasma cutter at all. I can easily see myself dying here, uh, because, uh, one, the damage isn't upgraded, and two, the fucking rate of fire is so slow. I've never died at this part, but when I did it on... Oh, wow, I actually made it. When I did it on Zealot, my only other Zealot run, I was at New Game Plus, so my fucking plasma cutter was like, you know, I think it was like two shots and the fucking thing blew up. Um, what's funny is I did this part with the uh, with the hand cannon, and I killed that guy so fucking fast that it zoomed up to that, that balcony, like that ledge where he was on, before the guy was even up there. And then it came back to me moving around and then he just jumped up there like normal gameplay. Like he just appeared up there. I thought that was pretty cool. Like that's how kill that's how fast I killed the guy. All these little kids. A little better strategy if you watched my uh, demo video. A little better strategy this time around than me running in circles, screaming, and crying. I did a lot of crying. Don't get me wrong, but I'm just saying this strategy works better. Oh, how you doing there, Slasher? I'm so good, huh? Whee! Did he stick to the wall? No, I don't think he did. This is a great room to get the fucking achievement for impaling the guy to the wall. You know, send him flying over 17 meters and impale him to the wall. Because, uh, there's just so much room. 
Come here, come here, mofo. Yeah, crap I don't want. Crap I don't want and crap that is like almost worthless enough. Uh, it's like not even worth shit just to sell it. Give it up. Mm -mm -mm. Take the force energy and uh, whoa, grab that. Let's go. We're, we're nearing somewhat near the end of chapter five. Interesting. See how his other arm came off? That was amazing. Fucking shot him in the left arm, and uh, I I knew it didn't come off. I'm looking at it going, wow, that guy scared the shit out of me. I'm looking at his arm going, I know his arm didn't come off. And then I realized, oh, his fucking right arm came off. The arm I didn't shoot. Amazing. Oh, come on. Just see, there, I know there's limbs back there. Fuck it. That's when you get in bullsh into bullshit. I know there's fucking pointy limbs. Whoa, back the fuck. God damn it, you fucking son of a bitch. I know there's pointy limbs back there, and the motherfucker grabs like a useless arm or a leg, whatever the fuck it was. Thanks, Isaac, you shithead. Thanks for working with the enemy. Luckily, I just picked up some health packs. I mean, damage is, is uh. expectable. Ex what? That's not even a word, I, I don't think. Uh, it's expected to take damage, but it still pisses me off. Like, it is Zealot. You take a lot of damage when you get hit. The medium health packs really don't do shit, but uh, it still pisses me off when I get hit. Hope nothing comes up this balcony! What? Hey, his arm came off that I actually shot that time. Man, he fucking hauled ass, man. That guy's usually downstairs. He came up quick. Get exploded, splody arm. Yeah. What are we doing on time? I think we're doing pretty good here. We got we got enough time. We'll we'll be unless I get fucked in the butt. We'll uh we'll finish chapter five. Back up. That that was actually a stalker. I have no idea why there's a stalker here crawling on the ground. Those are the motherfuckers that were running at me before kicking the shit out of me in the last video. Uh. Now this was also the part I was talking about in the last video. I fucked it up and I yelled it's in chapter 5, blah blah blah. Elevator confused me. Cause I'm dumb. Ugh, I don't know. Why is it? I don't know why it is, but I sure love this delicious ice cold Coca-Cola that I'm drinking. Yeah! It's 1.30 in the afternoon now, so it's on the uh, delicious Coca-Cola. I have my orange juice with my breakfast. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba, I'm loving Coke. That's how it goes, right? Do you know that Coca-Cola pretty much invented Santa Claus? Like, he was like some fucking retard before Coke was like, no, 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 assholes. This is what he looks like. Fat guy, beard, red suit. Go with it. That's exactly why he's like the exact same colors as Coke. That shit was like, you know, when Coke first came out, I don't know if it was when it first came out, but it was like, you know, back in like 1653 or something. But look it up. It's, it's Coke is pretty much, uh, I, it's common knowledge. I, I just figured, you know, there's some assholes out there that don't know that. Um, that Coke is pretty much uh, responsible for the modern day look of Sandy Claus. Nightmare Before Christmas is awesome, by the way. It's a reference. Uh, this is the part you, for the love of God, do not want to have the force gun on. Uh, I'll have the plasma cutter on because that's all... I have, but anything but the fucking force gun. This, I died twice here, like a fucking moron. The first time, uh, I had the force gun equipped, so it was too late. By the time I realized I had it equipped and I tried to change it, the guy fucking killed me, and it's a quick time event. The second time, uh, I'm like, all right, ready to go. I get the plasma cutter. It's all, it's all just choking and hardcore. I beat the game three times before I played hardcore, and I, uh, I know I lied. I only beat it twice, but I beat it twice before I played hardcore. I never died on this guy, and I died twice on fucking hardcore. Um, the second time, because he's got these two orange parts, you got to shoot, as you'll see. You got to shoot the one in the lower right twice, and then shoot the one in the lower left twice. After I fucking shot the one in the lower right twice, I fucking couldn't find the one in the lower left. Like, ah, ah, where is it? And as soon as I saw it, it fucking killed me again. I had to go all the way back to chapter four to the beginning and do the whole thing again twice, twice. So I, so I did chapter four. I did chapter four up to this point 
three fucking times. First time I got here, and then I died two more times. I had to come all the way back. That sucked. I was pissed. I was contemplating recording um, the video for playing hardcore, but I just didn't want to record like, you know, seven and a half hours just for when I died. I mean, I died, and I knew I was going to die, but I didn't want to fucking celebrate the goddamn shit. I want to throw a fucking party in the streets when I died. But maybe I should have. Yeah, we should land right about in chapter six. Some this is all like cutscene shit and quick time events. There's no more enemies all the way until chapter six. Spoiler alert, I ruined it. This is great, by the way. No! Oh, she got de-armed! Oh, oh, get the fuck! Oh, he got de-headed! And look at this guy, look, he's still holding on. Really, dude? Real look at him, he's like, shot, shot, hold on! Isaac's like, get the fuck out of here. Just kicks his ass into fucking space. <laughs> it just doesn't even make any sense. Like, Isaac was on the ground, and it seems like he was barely being pulled, right? He was just kind of, like, grabbing the ground a little bit. Then when he was hanging on that railing, like, he was being sucked the fuck out into space. You know, his whole body was, was, was fucking, uh horizontal facing out the window like with such force you'd think he'd get sucked right to that fucking railing but i don't under i don't understand the complicated process of you know interplanetary uh space nonsense so you gotta shoot this thing so the first time i tried shooting it had the goddamn fucking uh force gun equipped so he ate me uh and then the second time i got this far when well, the second time yeah the second time i got this far and basically that happened. Exactly what happened right there. Um, I was shooting at it, so I don't know what the fuck I was hitting just now. Um, but that's what happened the second time. Um, but fortunately, this did not happen. Well, fortunately, this is happening now, not on Hardcore, where it's like, oh, you did a no-no, try it again. Yeah, you don't get that fucking uh, privilege in Hardcore. It's, you just lost an hour and a half. I don't know what the fuck I was hitting. I was shooting right at this goddamn thing and it was crapping away. Hey, keep this shit out of the way. Yeah, that goddamn pipe was in the way. Come on, Jesus fucking Christ. There we go. I literally could not shoot past that fucking pipe. Let me tell you, if that was a hardcore game, holy shit, I would have fucking lost it. Like, if that's how I died in hardcore, like, I was pissed. Of course I was, because I died anyway. But at least I died because it was my fault, because I'm stupid. If I died because a fucking pipe, like, happened to fall in the way of his limb, holy shit, dude. That would not have been pretty. This is just an amazing cutscene here. Look at this shit. You fly in there, and then... Oh, shit. The fucking harvesters. I always gotta fuck shit up. This part's easy. All you gotta do, as I'll demonstrate here, is aim for one of these barrels. Bam. Or he'll fucking eat your ass. And Isaac's fine somehow. He's a fucking trooper. That's how. That's how he's fine. Good job, Isaac. You, you trooper. Chapter 6. Whoa! Find a save point. Here comes Strauss to fucking piss me off some more because he loves it so much and he's good at it. Guy's fucking annoying as shit. I don't know if you're uh, paying attention or if you can pay attention over me screaming, but he's a fucking. More fucking candles. Seriously, again. One. Where do they get this many candles from? Who the fuck do they do they make the candles on the ship or did somebody pack? candles and bring them with them because you're in outer space so did someone pack 15 like freight freighters of candles because i don't think the fucking necromorphs are doing it just saying god damn they're everywhere i think i'm back where i was which is why there's candles here but i'm, I'm in a uh, general area but Jesus Christ with the fucking candles. I would I would knock them all over. I would burn this place to the ground out of principle. I don't want this shit all over the place. Stop throwing it in my face. Yeah, I get it. You fucking love candles so goddamn much. You love them so much, fucking marry them. Ugh. All right. All right. Good job, guys. Um <clears throat> Chapter 6. Here we go. Nice. 
We're only at about two hour, two and a half hours maybe? I'm gonna cheat, I'm gonna look. What are we at? We are at... Holy shit, two hours and seven minutes, what the fuck? Oh, that's right, I saved it just before. Okay, I was like, god damn. I beat that whole level in five minutes? I'm good. Uh, that's that, and fuck you. See you in chapter six, part six.